Alright everyone, hello, what is up? The Loganators here and welcome back to another live stream. Today we are playing a different type of game. This is Digital Combat Simulator. This is a simulator, not a game. Although you can play it like a game, it's still a simulator. The planes are so accurately modeled and everything in this, I want to say game, but it's a simulator. It's just, it, it feels like what you would do to train on a real, like, you know, fighter plane or something like that. But today, we are taking out this plane. This is one of the planes they give you for free in the game. It's actually a free-to-play game for those who want to check it out. It's called DCS World. And uh, this is a ground attack aircraft multi-role. Uh, you can actually do some air-to-air -air combat, combat, which is what we're about to do. We're going to go up against the A-10 Warthog. But first, let me pull up the live stream on my phone so I can say hello to everyone there. Hello, hello, hello. Who is in the stream? We have myself. Welcome. <laughs> Heating tie 44Z. Welcome back to the stream. And Caesar, welcome back. Quack and hi. Hello indeed. Welcome, welcome, welcome. So without further ado, let's get right into it. Uh, tell me if it is a little loud for you, if you can't hear my voice. Uh, I think I turned the volumes okay though, but you never know. Uh, so we're going to switch our mode to air-to-air -air combat, which is with the 6 key, and then we're going to switch, uh, well, yeah, we'll switch the interboard missiles. Now we need to go get a lock on one of these planes. We're going up against two of these. Uh, deploying flaps. This is why you have a, this is why sometimes in these games that you need track IR, virtual reality. He's getting close, we're switching to guns. Alright, let's pull up. Ah, missed it. Turning in. That's my angle of attack warning right there. If you pull the plane too hard, it's gonna go violently out of control. Alright, we're gonna try and pull in. It looks like the other A-10 is going away, okay. Missed that one. I really w uh, would like a track IR headset or uh, virtual reality, because that would help a lot. In simulators such as this. Come on, there he is. He's deploying flares. Couldn't quite get him in my gun sight, so I didn't open fire. I'm just trying to perform a scissor maneuver right now. Oh, that was close, that was close. He's deploying flares. Woo! It's close when we're diving towards the ground right now, and it's a little concerning. Hopefully we don't, you know, crash. Oh, he's pulling up. He's pulling air brakes. We're gonna do the same. Oh! Throttle up, throttle up, throttle up. We got him on that one. Look, there he goes. Woo! Good kills there. Good kills, good kills. It's been a long time since I've seen you, and the reason is school. Well, the reason is, uh, partially school why I can't livestream all the time, so, you know. Big priority, but, you know, I gotta livestream sometimes. God, that's loud. Alright. I don't have visual on- oh, there he is. Luckily, they have call signs right above it. I probably should disable that just for realism's sake. Oh, let's, uh... Let's go to missile. Lock. Firing. Missile away. Come on, hit, hit, hit. Woo! We hit him. He's not dead yet. We'll have to finish him off with guns. There he is. Look at him smoke. Is he going down? I don't know if he's going down yet. He's definitely hurt, though. His right wing is, uh... Looks like a fuel leak. My guy's uh, breathing really heavily right now because of the G-forces. Alright, come on. Let's get around. Let's get around. I can't tell if he's going down or not. We're going to throttle up. Full throttle. Alright, bring the throttle back down actually because we got inside of him. Ah, barely missed him on that. Don't want him to cut inside me, which it looks like he might be doing right now. 
Ah, I'm losing control, I'm losing control. Battle left, battle left, battle left. Yeah, I'm stalling. Looks like my microphone cut out there. I have this backup one. I'm using the blue snowball for some reason. It cuts out a lot, and it's really annoying. Uh, there we go. There we go. All right, I got it back. It's better sound quality, but you know it just doesn't work some of the times. It gets really frustrating. Uh, thank you for calling it out in the chat, though. Sorry about that. Rip the mic. Alright, we're back in. Let's let's go and log into that uh, mission again. Because I want to beat it. I want to beat that. I want to destroy that. <laughs> yeah, that, that loud microphone right there, that was the webcam. And you know the webcam sound quality. You know the, the webcam sound quality. It's just absolutely terrible. So sorry about that. Sorry I had to destroy your ears for a quick second there. But it's, it's, it's good now. It's good. Play Fortnite. I will play Fortnite. Do not worry. In the very, very near future, I will play Fortnite. Alright. Switching to air to air mode. Toggling missiles. We have luck. Opening fire. Fox 1 away. I think that was Fox 1. I couldn't do it that time. Deploying flaps. Zooming out. Unfortunately, that missile was distracted and couldn't land uh, on the target because of those flares. However, we're cutting into the target now. Whoa. There they are. Come on. Oh, wow, I wasn't switched to guns. Dang it, I thought I was switched to guns there. That was a perfect aim. Ah, I missed him on that. We're gonna pull up. Before you know, we die. Getting a little close to the ground. Oh shoot. <laughs> no! <laughs> Hello, I'm back. Welcome back. Is this in Star Wars backwards? I'm unsubscribing. Ah, uh, look at that A10. Flying triumphantly in the skies, but no! We will not allow that to happen. We shall destroy those A10 Ford Hawks. Those capitalist pigs will fall prey to the oh, SU-25 Fark foot. Sorry if I went a little too much communism there. Air to air mode. Missiles locked. Air missiles engaged. We have a lock fire. Two missiles away. Missed him on that, missed him on that. 
Blink flaps. There's two warthogs. One of them just looked like it declared deployed flares again. <laughs> the two missiles probably shook them a little bit. We're gonna ramp up a throttle just a tad there. Bring it down just a bit. There we go. When you come up on this guy. Come on, you just gotta get close enough, and then we'll engage. Well, we already have engaged, obviously. Just need to get. Oh, we can outturn him. That's a good thing. Oh, hit him, hit him. Hit him again. Definitely hurt him there. Definitely hurt him there. In fact, he might be going down. We're gonna perform a scissor maneuver. That's what it's called. <laughs> Something like that. Uh, yeah, we definitely heard him up. He's deployed air brakes from the looks of it. Come on. We're gonna leave him be. He's hurting up for now. Looks like that a other A-10 is like running, maybe? Yeah, welcome everyone to the stream. There's a lot of people this time. Switching air to air mode. Missiles engaged. Let's hopefully we can lock onto this target. We're quite a distance away, so we're gonna pull up a throttle and hopefully we can catch him. Did we actually take that one guy down? Yeah, it looks like he's going down. We really beat him up good. Oh, we have a lock. Fire. Missile one away. Fox one away. I still need to uh, practice my terminology. We have another good lock for firing again. And that's the last of our missiles. We only have a bit of ammunition left on our gun, so we gotta be careful. Death Trooper, welcome back! Hopefully those missiles hit. That'd be very, very nice. We're going a little too fast right now. Missile 1 missed. Missile 2... Oh, we hit him! We hit him! He's hurt. He's hurt bad. Looks like he's going down, actually. Let's follow him down. Yeah, he's going down. Yeah, bye. We're going to make sure we don't die, too. And it looks like that other A-10 is still airborne, so let's go get him. Is my English good? Yes, it is. I think I know why. <laughs> Google Translate for the win. Look at him trailing and behind, uh, trailing that fuel tank. And I think there was oil too last time we hit him. If we don't get him with the rest of our ammunition, he's still gonna die. I mean, he's there's no way he can make it back to base like that. I know we shot up his tailplane really nicely too. Three people watching, cool beans, cool beans. We're gonna give him a pass and we're gonna get on a six and we're gonna finish him off. There he goes, he barely has any airspeed. We're gonna throttle down ourselves so we can get behind him. Beautiful play right there. Don't mess with communist decret. Far superior than any capitalist design. Oh, let's speed up actually. We're going really slow. We're gonna raise our flaps. Alright, we're gonna be getting behind him. He's got his navigation lights on. We don't have much left in our ammo reserves. Out of all the times we shoot, we've shot, we brought our uh, ammunition storage down to less than a quarter, so we gotta be really careful here. Nevertheless, we're gonna fire. That's a hit, but we're out of ammo. There's nothing we can really do now. Oh. Don't want to do that, though. That's one of the things we don't want to do. 
He's going down. This is pretty much game over for him. Well, that was a good run. We're out of ammo, though, unfortunately, so we can't really kill him. Do we have any missiles left? And we don't have any missiles left. Well, I'm going to exit the mission now. That was a good run. Good kills, good kills. Alright. What do we got next? We can do... Let's do Sam Killer. Let's see if we can destroy some Sams. I don't know if we can. It's going to be tough. That's not, That's for sure. We have to see what weapons we have, though. Maybe we can you know, get cluster bombs or GPUs or something like that. That'd be nice. Oof, oof, oof. Oof. All right, what do we got here? Uh, oh, the one thing I haven't learned yet is the electronic countermeasures and the targeting pod. This could be interesting. Hmm. Destroy both uh, SA-6 radars and SAM sites. All right. This is going to be interesting. <laughs> All right, let's do this. Trip is on. Oh, can we not? Oh shoot, we're being detected. We're gonna drop down. Drop down to low altitude here. Well, what, what weapons do we have? There we go. So that's our laser guided pod, I think. We're gonna switch to that. Oh, we got an S, another one. Oh, there we go. Triple A, let's go for it. We're gonna use computer generated uh, release. Or the. There's a better name for that. Oh, we got locks. They're locking on. <laughs> I think we had a, I think we had a rapid unplanned disassembly there. I think before we go against some Sams, we need to practice first. Oof. Oof, that's a big goof right there. Let's, uh, let's go to the training, I guess. Whoa, what, what, what are we looking for here? We need... Laser guided miss. Do we really want to do that right now, though? I think we should. <laughs> it might take a while for me to learn. It might get a little boring for you guys. So let's uh. <laughs> An aqua. <laughs> that was a, a major oof right there. <laughs> oh. Oh no 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 no! Don't open! Don't open the cockpit. <laughs> Can we? I guess we can't do that. Okay, never mind. All right, air to ground. We'll turn this on because it looks cool. Very technical. We're going to switch to. What are we going to switch to? Oh, I see. We'll switch to that. And we have it selected. Getting ready to fire. These are my HVR missiles or rockets. They're not HVR, actually, the, the, the HVR is Russian, I mean, uh, American, I'm pretty sure, so we'll fire. Three, two, one. There goes the spread of rockets. Wow, that's a lot of smoke. Good kills, good kills. Oh! Ooh! Taking some flak. Some anti-air. There goes the BMP. Punch throttle, let's get the heck out of here. I'm not getting a master caution or anything, so it looks like, uh, or any alarms in the cockpit, so it looks like we're alright there. That, uh, we'll switch to those bombs. Alright, 
turning around. <laughs> turning around, yeah. We're going to use these on computer release. So then the computer will uh, kill the ground targets for us. There's a reticle. That's a big pocket of enemies right there, so we're going to go for them naturally. We have a lock. Bombs away. Bombs away. Good hits, good hits. Switching to air to air mode. We're gonna try to take down that chopper with our missiles. I really want to do Hearts of Iron 4. Definitely on my bucket list. Definitely gonna do that. Hopefully soon. Next time I get a Steam gift card. Hearts of Iron 4, baby! Hearts of Iron 4! Speaking about that, if you want to donate so I can get Hearts of Iron 4 earlier, feel free to do so. It's going to be a lot harder when I turn off the uh, tags above the enemy. There's the Huey. Lock. Fire. Firing two. Hit. Yeah, he's going down. He's going down. That's one uh, one kill. The helicopter has been destroyed. Helicopter's been destroyed. Sweet. We're gonna still use these bombs. Let's uh. Release them. Just switch these up. I'm pretty sure this is. Yeah. We're gonna drop two at a time this time. And we're gonna drop them at 0.2 second intervals. Wow! I love training. <laughs> and do cool stuff like that. Alright. Line up the targets. That's the wrong. Oh, rat of bombs. Pull up. Guess we're out of bombs. Never mind. Here comes the anti air. We're gonna full throttle this and get the heck out of here. This thing climbs like a spaceship. Look at this. Not gonna go too hard in the engine though. Preparing to fire. This time we're gonna fire laser guided missiles. I don't know how to fire these, so this could be interesting. Coming around here. This is not working. <laughs> Second crash. Second crash. Oh, look at this boy. Well, we definitely took out a lot of your friends, so I'm happy. <laughs> Alright. We are also in the free version of this game. You also get the T-51D, which is the trainer plane for the P-51 fighter plane. So let's uh, let's grab that up. We're going to do a cold start. I need to practice my taxiing in this plane because it's pretty bad. That was a pretty bad crash. All right.
I don't know why the guy was like breathing so heavily there. That was weird. All right, so this is the plane. Nothing compared to the uh, very nice Cold War attack jet for the Soviet Union, but still gets the job done. That's for sure. Well, at least it did. Here she is. Beautiful, isn't she? One of my favorite fighters of World War II. Anyways, let's get her started. Uh, pull in the overhead thing here. Nice. We'll flip the mirror. Ooh, oh, don't want to do that. There we go. I remember things. Hey, perfect. All right, we're going to raise the flaps here. Flaps raised. Garburetor air control. We're going to flip the fuel flow on. Igniter switch to both. Fuel booster. We're going to flip that up in preparation. We're going to turn on the electrical systems. We're going to dim the cockpits just a tad. There we go. Beautiful, beautiful. And I believe that's all we need. We're going to wait for this to start up. Perfect. All right. Let's get ready. We can do that. And that. Cool. Couldn't quite get to start that time. We'll try again. Gotcha started that time. Nice. All right. Here comes our flaps. So we got the thing ready to go. And there goes the flaps. All right, let's taxi up now. This is where the tricky part is. Taxiing is extremely difficult. Well, if you don't practice it, then it is. Don't want to break the propeller, that would not be great. <laughs> it's so tricky! Alright. There we go. That's good enough for now. Alright, let's just get this show on the road, shall we? Uh, not my most beautiful takeoff. Definitely not my most beautiful takeoff. Uh, looks like we damaged the right wing pretty good. Bring the bottle back just a tad. There we go. Let's check out the damage. <laughs> uh, the flap is gone. The aileron is gone. Don't worry, we're still flying it though. We are still flying it, so that's good. There we go, we just can't roll that well. In between the grains. Nice. Alright, let's bring her down. Beautiful. Not really, but at least we're still in one piece. See, I can fly. I know how to fly. Nice and easy. Nice. All right. Well, even though we took off terribly and we damaged the plane, we still made it down, so that's fantastic. Oof. Well, I think we're probably trained and warmed up and everything, so why don't we do a mission? Hmm. 
Hmm. Unguided bombs practice. What do we have right now? Situation, take off. Locate ground targets around waypoint three. Destroy ground targets, land at airfield. Useful key commands, navigation mode, cycle waypoint control, left control plus, air to ground seven, release weapons is space, destroy targets at waypoint three. Uh, I'm not too sure what those are yet. Temperature's only 19 degrees. Wow, that's cold. Let's do it. Let's destroy some capitalist, capitalist pigs. We shall destroy the capitalists once and for all. Oh, no fair. I wanted a taxi. Can I just actually... Where's the, uh... Okay, cool. I think we're ready. Let's, uh... Throttle her up. beans. We'll take a look at third person. Looks beautiful. Alright. Oh, we're in a little off course there. Rotate. 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 I think I rotated a little too early there. Gear up. Flaps up. Not too sure what you're saying. I don't speak Russian, comrade. I ran a lower down the throttles because we picked up sufficient airspeed. Sweet, we're in the air. Now we're just going to follow the waypoints. find these guys. Uh, right control. What? Alright, we could get a little lost here. I'm not too sure how to navigate that well yet, so we're kind of lost here. Uh, excuse me. Maybe that's where you want me to go? We're gonna try this. Hi, DK. Oh, uh, Evan, please, welcome to the stream. We're gonna make a turn. Turn this way. Well, then, I am very, very lost. I think, because I don't know which one is the, uh,
I don't know which one is the uh, one with waypoints. Hmm. <laughs> if I knew which one was waypoints, I know where I need to be going. But you see, there's no waypoints. Ha. Huh. Well then. I don't know. I'm kind of lost here. What I'm looking at down here, this like compass thing, that's my indicator to my navigation indicator. So let's bring the throttle down on this attack. I'm just going to say that this is the way. That's what I'm going to say. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. I don't think this is the airport. Oh, fly this way. Do you know the way? I do not know the way right now. And it's a little concerning. Actually, we do have a targeting pod here. What's our loadout? Oh, we have those cluster bombs. That's nice. Yeah, the cluster bombs are really, really nice. Alright, let's, let's navigational mode again, shall we? cinematic view there. Uh, yeah, we're just gonna go this way. We're gonna full throttle this, get there as fast as we can. Am I flap still up? Guess we're not. Alright. It's over 700 kilometers an hour. Still don't have visuals on the targets. Don't even know if I'm heading the right way, but we're about to find out. Once we get there. Do babbity beep bappa do Brilliant. Alright. I think after this we can try doing uh, no instrumentation, uh, no like zero visibility, zero visibility landing, which is very very tough because you have to rely on only your instruments and it gets a little complicated. Looks like we're like four kilometers away. I think that's, I'm reading it right. This is it. This is it. That was waypoint one.
Maybe. That's just taking me back to the airport, though, isn't it? I'm so confused. I'm just gonna land. <laughs> I'm just not right now. I need to learn my navigation better. Because, boy, it's hard to navigate. This is 797 requesting landing. Can't call anything in right now. Oh, deploy air brakes. I guess you can't request landing in this. Guess not. Just a little too hot right now. Just a little bit. That was an awful approach I'm pulling off. Terrible, terrible approach. I came in twice as fast as I should have. Good thing we pulled off from that. Oh, a train. Would you look at that? Going right at right. Are they gonna hit each other? Oh no, there's two tracks. Okay. I'm like, wow, those trains are going really fast, really like right at each other. Oh, throw it all up. Pineapples. Comment, uh, pineapples if you're still here. I'd like to know who's still here. Looks so distorted when it seemed down like that. Pineapples! Hold on, I'll read that comment right after I land. Something about a teacher and a kid. I'm lining up for the wrong thing. That's the taxiway, not the runway.
Guy's still waiting to take off. There we go, that braking shoot really helps. Oh, I actually destroyed my wheel! Look at it, it's destroyed! Wheels completely destroyed there. Well, we made it down, so that's that's good. Real Mad Hater Gaming, welcome to the stream. This kid got in trouble because the teacher was yelling at the student because he was talking. The killed guy yelled, Why are you running? Running in the 90s. <laughs> Oof, why are you running? Oof, didn't mean to do that. On to uh, another dogfight or something. Uh, or yeah, whatever. Whatever. Let's do dog fight again. I was gonna do like landing a night or something, but you know, whatever. I quite enjoy this dog fight. Great dog fight here. Okay, he's gonna dodge your missiles expected. Pulling flaps. We're gonna go for Enfield 11. Wow, that was fast. Alright, we're gonna go for Field 12 then. Switching to radar guided missiles. Oof, that's a hit, that's a hit. Doesn't look like you killed him now. Good show. Oh, that took off his wing. He ejected. He's going down. Another jet coming in. Full throttle. We're switching to air-to-air -air missiles. Missile away. We have one missile remaining. We're going to try and get close and personal and use the missile here. Normally you'd use a gun, but you know, I want to use this missile. Come on. We have a lock. Ah, freaking lock. Firing. It's in, it's in, it's in. Bam! Direct hit, direct hit. He's hurt, he's hurt, he's hurt. Firing guns. Close, that's close. Oh, that's hit on his left wing. Is he going to eject? I think he just did. And that's mission accomplished right there. goes. Oh, 
nice form. Both aircraft have been destroyed. Let's escape and Beautiful. We're gonna eject for fun. <laughs> Where's our plane? There it is. <laughs> you can actually walk around to see a guy in the game, which is kinda cool. I literally just got a 199 meter sniper knock. Ah, oh, nice! I think your channel died when you were at Danger. How much dash? Well, I will revive it. I will revive it then with air to air combat. I got a medal, that's kinda cool. Let's try the Sam Killer mission again. Because why not? On the other side of the hills ahead are two SA-6 SAM sites protected by two short-range SA-8 SAMs. Also in the area is quite a bit of anti-aircraft artillery. Destroy both SA-6 radars and both SA-8 SAMs. Press escape and then select free and you can view a list of useful PPMs. <laughs> Roger that, let's get ready to engage. We have locks. Fighter, is he gonna get shot down? That's what happens when you try and use aircraft to assault an anti-aircraft facility. <laughs> Just saying. My worthy to have, mod. Ah, uh, well, if you come here a lot, and you are a good person, then I will make you mod. Uh, I don't know if I'm the second person to do the Maya Show solo. They haven't been here in a while. Why well, haven't live streamed a while? I, I think there's a few more people who've done it solo. Uh, Doofy Doofy, I will give you mod if you come back to the next live stream. How about that? Let's try that dogfight again. I really like that dogfight. It's kind of weird a dogfight in a plane that was meant for ground attack, so it's like, what? Uh, Switching air to air. Fire. Box one away. Losing control, losing control. The plane flaps. Alright, it's under control from the most part. He's gonna be able to cut inside of us easily though. I don't have a visual on the other fighter plane. Or the other plane, not really a fighter plane. Switching air to air. Missile lock, bread fire in 3, 2, 1, Fox 2, away. He's able to elude it with flares, unfortunately. Pulling up on his 6, couldn't engage with guns. See the other plane, 1.5 and ML, what is that, nanometers? I, I don't know what that stands for, I don't think it's, no, it can't be nanometers. On his six. There he goes. Come on, I got you. Hope the other eight ten is not on my six right now. Oh, 
Oh, I hit him, I hit him. Just like he was hit on the right wing. He's got a fuel leak right now. He's deploying flares. He's trying to get the heck out of here right now. on those. Come on, come on. Oh, that's it, that's it. Another hit, another hit. Did we clip him on that? <laughs> Look at that! We hit him with our wingtip and he went down. Beautiful deal. If I deploy the air brake right now, it won't let me. My air brake is destroyed on my uh, left wing. Yeah, my left wing air brake destroyed. I right, now we continue our hunt for the next A10. Good kills. When is next stream? Probably this weekend. Maybe Friday, something like that. Not too sure. Just kind of happens every so often, randomly. Where is that A10? Is he down low? I feel like I'm hearing him right now. It's not on my six, is he? What? What do heck? We have lost visual of the other A10. We're gonna continue circling up here. Oh, oh, wait. Is that him? Or is that the downed one? No, that's him, alright. Switching air to air missiles. Have him lined up right in the crosshairs. Doesn't look like he's going down. We're gonna finish him off with another missile. It's a good dive on him, though. Uh. Point blank with a missile? No, not gonna happen. That's gonna happen, though. And that's a GG right there. Beautiful. From who suffered minimal damage, just that air break. We rammed that one plane with the air break. Awesome. That was so much fun. Uh, closer support, easy. I wonder if there's a campaign for the other plane? No. Definitely gonna do the campaign in the near future sometime. Left control. Uh, it's that. That's what I was doing wrong, okay. Ramp start navigation. Start both engines, taxi to runway, take off, navigate waypoints, land at designated airfield. That's a lot of waypoints. That's 19 waypoints. Woo! Let's 
do this. This is a cold start. This is a cold start. Another SU-25 frog puts in the area. On the runway. Alright, let's start up engines. We're going to do... What's home? That's the right engine on. Why is the left engine not on? Let's close the cockpit. Could get a little loud. Right engine's good. What happened to the left engine? What's the story on engine number one? I don't understand why engine number one's not starting. Oh, okay. Apparently, the right engine is the left engine. Makes sense. Makes sense. Uh, how do I turn on the other stuff? Because I completely forgot. How do I turn on electronics? I know how to turn in engines. Uh, I'm at a loss here. <laughs> There's so many buttons. I don't know. It's not I. Is it? Is it J? Lower the flaps for pressing F. Well, I know how to do that. Well, I can't do that because the electronics are not on. What are the electronics? Maybe it's just home itself. No. Well, I completely forgot. Wait, 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 what do we got here? What if, what can we look for? E? Control E? Alt E? Uh... General. E... For electronic. Power switch is right shift L. Never would have guessed that. Was the right control though? There we go. Why are you beeping at me? There we go. God, this game. Okay, I've got this. All right, I know. All right, what 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 what's next? I think I think I I think I can take it from here. Okay, sweet. We are going to request taxi. I said we are going to request. Ah! Why? I think it's the wind. Uh, how do I request taxi? That's under communications. That that's that. Where do I go to click that? Uh, I see. There we go. Air traffic controller. I want to taxi. Excuse me. Excuse me. What am I looking at right now? <laughs> you can request repair? That's kind of cool. God, this game is so complicated. I'm sorry, this simulation is so complicated. The 
don't speak Russian. Where do I go to taxi? I don't care. Screw you, air traffic controller. I'm just gonna taxi on my own here. Uh, okie dokie then. Turn off the lights. Here we go. Is the parking brake engaged? That seems like it's not. I uh, uh, yeah, request take off. Let's not tip over the plane, shall we? Alright, I got this, thank you so much. Araski, Habratushta, Anamarandar Shinga. What a beautiful day to fly. Oh, we are on the wingtip clearance line. That's not where we want to navigate by. <laughs> oh, there's so much to learn in this game. Learning curve is so steep. Super fun though, I really enjoy this. Hope you guys too. Hope you guys do too, because it's kind of interesting actually. There's this one guy that I really like to watch called Max TV. He flies a bunch of DCS missions. In fact, he uploaded a video earlier today where he flew a Harrier off the aircraft carrier and he had to fly low over Russian airspace and it was pretty cool. I least suggest you go check that channel out if you're into flight simulators, combat, World War II, you know, that type of stuff. I'm requesting takeoff. Do you do you copy? Ready to depart. Request request takeoff. I think I heard that um you have to be like literally right next to the runway if you want to ta uh I mean take off not taxi. Oh, Shin Mayum, take me by the hand. Sure, why not? We'll go this way. Can you say quack? Yes, I can say quack. Yes, yes, yes. Quack a doo doo doo. Ba ba doo ba doo. Ah! Don't want to do that. Okay, wheel brakes. I am a great pilot. Please stop. Okay. I request take off. Okay, 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 I get it. Please turn. Thank you very much. And full throttle. Yay! I can drive a plane! <laughs> now we're getting somewhere. And we're going a little to the right, so let's correct that. We're going to rotate at 240 kilometers per hour. Rotate. We 
are airborne. You're up. Thing loves to climb like a rocket. Okay, navigation mode. Currently heading towards waypoint one. Beautiful. Nice song, much thinking. We'll have to work on it. Gotta go, bye. Bye, see ya, boy. Alright, so now we fly the designated waypoints that we've been, uh, well, we fly through the waypoints, and then we get to the, uh, airfield and we land. Beautiful. Where's the tilde? Whatever that thing is. Uh, yeah, okay. Navigation is not working. Fantastic. Really wish this navigation will, navigation in the computer would work. I'm trying to cycle through the waypoints, but it just simply won't let me. Excuse me. Oh, now it's working. There we go, waypoint one is, why is that so far away? Uh, that, that must be wrong. Yeah, that can't be the right whip points. That's gotta be it. Okay. Turning around. This navigation is a little tricky. Because there's not much you gotta net you. There's not much you can do. Back in World War II, they had designated people working on navigations on bomber crews because navigation is pretty darn tricky. You don't want to get lost, that's for sure. Definitely don't want to, like, run out of fuel out of their enemy territory. Very, very bad. But I think we've got the correct heading now. Don't know why that line keeps telling me to go left. I think it's lying to me. I gotta trust my uh, instruments on the dash instead. Not what's on my heads up display. Is that being said, let's move in. And let's follow the waypoints. Thank you for flying near Logan Nether. I do hope you enjoy your flight. We're expecting a few bumps along the way. But not to worry, I don't think any capital is their craft will try and fight us. The destroy us or anything. That's always a good thing. Capital estate and the war dogs. I cannot talk with a Russian accent right now. 
Trusting my navigation. Trusting my navigation. Nope, I, I'm not doing the right thing. I'm not doing the right thing. I need to follow the yellow line. Aha! Now I get it, kinda. I get it. I get it. I'm, I, I get it. Okay. We are on our way to the airfield. Fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. Let's go full throttle, speed this up. Uh, let's just see, uh... Beautiful. Beautiful. Got external fuel tanks mounted, actually, right now. Do-ba-do-ba-ba-do. Zoom out to get a greater sense of speed. Oof. How low can you go? Well, let's find out. Going almost 800 kilometers an hour, that's quite fast. Approaching waypoint two, two kilometers out, or I think that's the NM measuring distance. And if I read it right, there's like 16 waypoints, so we're gonna turn into that. That's waypoint three, beautiful. Turn to the left for waypoint four. Let's bring her in low. Fantastic, I can now navigate. I'm smart, I am smart. Yeah, I'm not gonna pull up yet. Oh, waypoint five. Let's turn into it. I'm pretty sure the white is like the next waypoint after this. But it is your port. But about your bubble. But about bubble. Somebody once told me this plane was kind of baloney. I ain't the sharpest plane in the ship. Such a great remix, 10 out of 10. Waypoint six. Quite a further distance out. Do, 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 full throttle. I wonder, uh, there's probably overheating on the engine, so I gotta be careful. Don't know how to tell if there is overheating, but we'll find out. Just another chill flight. Is starting to shake. But 
that this fine. We are we are all good here. I wonder if this plane could go supersonic. Probably can in a dive. Yeah, it seems our like top speed is 860 kilometers an hour. Beautiful. Coming up on waypoint 6, ETA for 8 seconds out. Point point seven. I'm so happy I know how to navigate. Navigation's a little tricky. Definitely at first. Now it's pretty easy. Now I know where I'm going. Just follow the white. The, the, there's a yellow arrow just to the left of the joystick there. You follow that. Very, very useful. Turn left a bit. Nice, beautiful, beautiful. Just nice, smooth sailing from here. Okay, repoint. We've reached waypoint seven, going to waypoint eight. Just flying through the mountains. Let's go really low here. I think that's what we're supposed to be doing right now. Beautiful. That is beautiful. Those cars on the highway were like, whoa, look at that. up here. Nice, nice, nice. Oh, looks like we've reached the right point, going to waypoint nine. More than halfway down here. See how close we can get to this tree line. Woo. Now that's cinematic for you right there. Hold up, just so slightly. It looks like we're not going that fast, but fighting out just a bit. You can just tell that we're going even faster than what it seems. And we're going 530 kilometers an hour, which is more than, it's like around 270 kilometers an hour, I want to say. Shoot, I missed my point nine, gotta turn around. We really push this.
Those mountains look like they're a lot farther the away than they really were. And then I died. Well, well, well. Well, 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 well. How far are we into the live stream here? Hour and 30 minutes? Alright, I think what we should do one more time is, uh... What can we do? Let's do... Can't do multiplayer, can you? Uh, that sucks. Uh, let's do another dog fight. That's fine. Boy! But I know that was such a casual flight, and then I was turned around. Oh, I missed the white point. That mountain got really close. I'm like, oh no! Uh, boy, boy, boy! Doofy, oofy. What, what, what should we do though? Kind of at a loss right here. There's so much to do. I just don't know what to do though, because there's just too much. Let's get a lock. This little way. We have a missile miss deploying flaps. An A10 just has to underneath us. Is he gonna spray at us? Wow, that was close. Just got sandwiched in between the two. Not too happy about that. Don't remember this one. Oh, you're back, boy. Switching missiles, switching missiles. Missiles didn't land. Come on, where are you, where are you? He wants to go into a dive. Definitely, yeah, I'm good on that. Where's his friend? Oh, we got him on my six. That's not good. Nuclear GD, welcome to the stream. Switching air to air missiles. <laughs> Terrible miss. Should never have fired that. Oh, the more we learn. The guy smoking on her six is probably gonna lay a few cannon shots in. I didn't shoot. Oh, you're an easy target for my cannons, boy. Ah, you pulled up just in time. If you'd stayed in that just a little bit more, you would have been dead. Dead! When you stall like that, you're such an easy target for guns. Coming in. Whoop! I'm on, I'm good, I'm on, I'm good. I don't think the A-10s can outmaneuver the frog foot. Come on. Oh, 
Well, one of us is going to run out of altitude sooner or later. Looks like he's going to use that here. Really pushing the plane to its limits. Hit. Looks like I want to go into a stall. Don't go into flat spin. There we go. Oh, we're hit! We're hit! We are going down! Eject, eject, eject! Oh, you lucky son of a gun! We severely damaged two aircraft, but the other guy got on my six and got me! His friend was backing him up. Dang it, that was so close. Oh my god! Wow! That was crazy! That was crazy! I did not expect him! All of a sudden my plane started falling apart! Come on! We're gonna get you this time. Yeah, that's the power of uh, teamwork right there. Didn't know he was on my six like that. There's the other one. Attack. Come on, come on, come on. Uh, it makes me so nervous that there's two of them and I can't go for both at the same time. Switching air to air missiles. Yeah, you're checking after that one. Bye bye. Scratch one. Other one's on my six, isn't it? Okay, now we need to shake him. Can't shake this guy. Come on. Oh, 
Oh, he's breaking up. He's breaking up. This is our chance. I guess he got scared about the altitude. Don't crash. Okay, I was gonna say if you crash, that'd be no fun. Air to air missiles. That's one. He ejected. And that's GG. Nice. Beautiful. Nice one. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I can't believe they got me the first time though. That was a really good kill on his part. Oof, oof, oof. Alright. Well then, that's all I gotta say about that. I think that's gonna have to be it for today, guys. I had a lot of fun. I hope you've enjoyed the gameplay. It was a really, really cool uh, experience. The uh, I mean, this this simulator is completely free. Well, it's not completely free. I mean, you gotta pay for all this stuff. But, you know, it gives you some free planes, and it's super, super fun. I mean, it's just a lot of fun. I highly recommend you get check this game out. It's free. It's DCS World. Go check it out on Steam. I recommend you download it. Try it if your computer can handle it. That's awesome. So, uh, you know, with that being said, thank you guys for watching. I will stream this game and record, put out content on this game a lot, a lot more. Or simulator, whatever you want to call it. But uh, I think that's going to have to do it for today. I do hope you've enjoyed the live stream. I had fun, like I said. And I hope you guys had fun. And I will see you uh, next time. Thank you guys for watching so much. And adios. Goodbye, everyone. And thank you for coming. See you next time.